Hi guys, I made it to Nice, France, woohoo! Um, so this whole video is just gonna be me in France and yeah! <laughs> We've been here for what, like 30 minutes maybe? Um, <laughs> and now we're gonna try to go get some, what is it, coffee and croissants? Croissants. <laughs> croissants! <laughs> My face <laughs> Where he goes, Quaxon? Have you guys Cashed out for last, like, what time am I gonna bed at? You've been um, out for like an <laughs> hour and a half, maybe a little bit longer than that. We let you sleep for a little while. <laughs> um, Sarah also slept, um, yeah, a little now, <laughs> and we're gonna go to dinner soon. <laughs> I can't actually. We were gonna go back downtown. Which is a 20 minute walk for yeah. reference. Um, but then we decided against that. <laughs> my hair is crazy. Oh my gosh, I'm so exhausted. We've been, I was doing the math earlier. By yeah, the let's time we go to sleep, we will have been up for more than 30 hours. Well, I guess I had, I had fallen asleep. It's already more than 24. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's funny. <laughs> Only at 24 restaurants. <laughs> okay, so we finished with dinner, and honestly, it was absolutely delicious. It was so, it was so good. good. The three of us got the same thing, and then Elle got like a starter it was thing. Like trout. Oh, we're going. And beet sauce. It was really good. <laughs> um, and like lemon citrus. <laughs> and then there was these girls next to us that were. Um, American too, and we were like Studying chatting abroad in Barcelona. Yeah, and we were chatting with them for a while, and they were really nice. And our literally, the dessert was, awesome. was great. Yeah, our yeah. Oh, was great. Oh, and we all got wine pairings that matched with our meal. It was delicious. That was the first time I've ever done that, and it was truly, really like actually perfectly <laughs> awesome. <laughs> and then um, we got creme brulee, and that so was, <laughs> was like, oh but God. it was literally. The best creme brulee I've ever had in my life. It was like lemony. I don't know. It was delicious. Um, so I definitely recommend that restaurant. It was mwah. It's day two, and this is my outfit of the day. So I'm wearing a sweater vest from Sheen and a shirt from Amazon, um, skirt from Sheen, and then wearing these like fleece lined leggings, and then these shoes from a store. I actually have no idea, but yeah, there's the fit. So we're heading to go get. Croissant. <laughs> I say it wrong every time. Um, and then coffee, which I'm not much of a coffee drinker, but I feel like I had that chai yesterday and it was really good, which isn't much coffee. But I might try. I might try something else today. We'll see. <laughs> It's literally so pretty. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs>
fresh Caesar salad. Wait, what was that? What's this that, is, Matt? This is steak tartare, so she's raw beef. Like, oh. mixed with a bunch of things. That's really good. And then Interesting. The one thing about me is I'm so easily <laughs> persuaded. <laughs> and <laughs> Elle and Sarah both ordered a glass of rosé. And then, and then Natalie got ordered an espresso. An espresso, and I was like... He was like, do you want anything? And I was like, no, no, no. And then he convinced her. He convinced convinced her. I'm so easily convinced. So cheers. 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 <laughs> so opinions on the wine tour earlier. I really enjoyed it. Like truly. I really like chemistry. So like all the chemistry behind the wine was very exciting for me. She was asking a lot of questions. It was fun. <laughs> in a bad way. I meant like she was giving us more information because you were asking good questions. Sure. But I really liked it. Our tour guide was really nice. I thought she was really sweet and she knew a lot about what she was talking about. Yeah. And there were a bunch and of Americans like, in our group. Like, yeah. People with us too. Like it was all American it was college students. Yeah. So it was fun. And yeah. Yeah. And, yeah, and the wine fun. was tasty. I learned that champagne is a region. That was crazy. <laughs> she was confused why her parents kept bringing home sparkling wine in California. <laughs> <laughs> champagne. No, no. You do learn something new every day. <laughs> I had a lot of fun as well. I'm not like the biggest like wine drinker, but here I've been really enjoying the wine. Um, it doesn't taste as like like tarty Bad. and like chemically. <laughs> it it also doesn't, like, I feel like it tastes more chemically in America. Because it is. Um, and, <laughs> yeah. okay, it's it's far more organically here. here. Let's put that up there. Yeah. Like, far more organically. Everything is like grown. No pesticides. No herbicides. Nothing. Yeah. So. Better. Also, our <laughs> lunch delish. Um, so good. It started raining, and so he moved. Us yeah, under like a little into like awning. a. I you can't even see it, but a little awning. Um, and yeah, now we're just like sitting here and hanging out. the most beautiful set of bags I've ever seen. I love purple. Oh my gosh. I'm obsessed. If there's one thing I'm gonna gravitate towards, it's the purple things. I mean, these are so cute. We are back from shopping for a little while. And one thing that we didn't talk about at lunch about the wine tour is literally the people in our group, we had just seen them at the coffee shop that we had gone to. And then when we got there, we like went out of the chapel and they were like, oh, like how was Copenhagen coffee? Like how we were all there. What's the likelihood that we would have all been at the same coffee shop? And then what's even crazier is the other part of the group that was there. First off, it was like all people our age. And they went to the same college as the other people that like went to the Copenhagen like coffee place. And they all coincidentally signed up to go on the same wine tour, which is, was kind of funny, um, not together. So we talked to them for a while and they gave us like some recommendations of places to go tonight. And then when we were at lunch, once we were done, this French dude came up to us and like started asking us if we like went to school here and stuff, which was kind of fun too. So everyone's just really chatty. I don't know. I'm I'm enjoying it. <laughs> Number one. This whole meal is tapas, which I didn't explain. Okay, I always not. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we do three different. Dish number yeah, two. We, yeah, we Dish one. number three. Dish four. I'm about to check that. Dish number five. So Dish six. The fact that this might be the coolest bathroom I've ever seen in my oh, life. Really? How do you trim them? Like, it's giving Mama and Mia. Am I wrong? The coolest toilet I've ever seen in my life. First, you click the button, and it goes down, and the water goes in there. Like, I'm sorry, what? We walked all the way to the square again to get some gelato and it was closed even though it said it was open online. That's one thing we've noticed. Even if it says it's open online, like it doesn't always mean it's open, but we're just gonna go to a different bar now. Okay, so now we are at an Irish pub and we all got different drinks. So I'll show you guys what we all keep getting. Okay, so we got some drinkies. 
and then I've been in desperate need of water all day so I went and got a huge water bottle. We are heading currently to the bar. It's 12 13. To this, the bar. This might be okay a club whatever same diff the club. but <laughs> this might be the latest we've gone out this entire Guys, semester. I should you be in bed. I've never, no, not never, but like I haven't been out this late since like freshman year of college. Literally, we're so washed up. We're so and, European. And we're so spring breakers, or as they say here. Also, we're like day. Low, but we're going to a very popular club here for the for the study abroad students. Like, that like, I, but I also saw it on TikTok, so you know it's we real. Did, we did see it on TikTok, but the girl we met who studies abroad in Nice said this was the moment. So, yeah. so here we go. That's where we're going. Cheers! Oh wait, this is so good. This is just like alcohol. That's what I'm saying. The tonic is different. That's wild. is day three in Nice and now we are heading to Monaco actually so technically today is not gonna be spit mostly in Nice I got a beignet Okay, we made it to Monte Carlo. <laughs> we almost missed our bus. Or our, oh, my gosh, it's oh my goodness. Our phones weren't working for our tickets. And so we had to buy new train tickets, which was kind of annoying. But Nobody else is. They were only nine euros. We bought them for five online. Yeah. So at least they weren't expensive. But other people were having those that issue too, and they had no one there to help. Other people missed their trains. Yeah. No, seriously. Um, we almost missed ours. And then as we were going to ours, I swear like the steps must be different here, because <laughs> I ate like or I like I fell, <laughs> and it was so embarrassing, and I've fallen like multiple times on the stairs here. Um, so yeah, slay. <laughs> it's literally so pretty. It's so pretty. And it's so sunny out today. I'm so excited. That's the hotel that was in the Selena Gomez Monte Carlo movie. the best gelato I've ever had in my life. It's from Italy. I got, and it's from Italy. From Italy. I got a sorbet, but it's equally as good. <laughs> but it's so good guys. Like it also was like three euros. <laughs> which so was oh crazy. I literally am shocked. Wow. Yeah. Like also, anyways. The guy was so nice. I know he was really nice. and it started raining on us on the way home and the train was packed. I was literally standing and had like nowhere to put my hands. So that was a blast. But we're just hanging out in the hotel room and depending on whether we might order food in because it's kind of rainy outside. We ended up ordering out food and I got fried rice and shrimp. I, except for I don't even see the shrimp. <laughs> Finally got a crate. It's banana, Nutella, and something called chintale. Do you think that's chintale? Yes, probably. Okay. And then orange juice. For breakfast, we went and got crepes, and they were absolutely delicious. I've been wanting them. And it was really good service. 
The atmosphere is just so good here. And now we're walking um, to go to the antique market in old or like downtown Nice. around old niece again and I got a bar of soap um and lavender it was lavender <laughs> he said it was a best because, seller well because <laughs> lav the lavender fields are right back here yeah the famous ones myself my first set of macarons my first Literally, except for you're not even in the clip. <laughs> I saw it immediately. I That's too. so Wait, cool. I like this color. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. It's your favorite color. <laughs> okay, we're at Hoppy Hour right now. And me and Sarah got Mamma Mia. What did you get? Um, an Amor Amor. And oh. I it a lot. <laughs> and yeah, it's happy hour. So instead of nine euros, it was six. Okay, so this week they had their carnival. We couldn't get tickets, but look at this float for America. It's like Disney and Liberty, Marilyn Monroe, all, all these things. It's kind of cute. And then there's like all these other carnival-esque things. This looks delicious. Oh, look, that's his biggest face. Do you see that? It's bigger. Sorry, yeah. Got our cards. Okay, we are heading to the airport. We went and got some uh, uh, chocolate chocolates this morning, and um, we're taking the tram to the airport. 